Williams, an off-duty Pasadena cop, is accused of hitting an HPD patrol car. Yeah, both the Pasadena police officer and an HPD officer that was inside that cruiser were taken to the hospital. Zach Lajway is live on the Beltway Feeder Road near South Wayside. Is that scene still active, Zach? Amy, this feeder road is still closed. However, the scene is almost fully cleared. You can see this is the final car being towed away involved in this crash. According to police, two HPD units responded to a stalled Ford Explorer at 242 this morning. One unit parked behind the stalled vehicle. The other is was in the middle lane. Both units activated their lights. Officers discovered the driver was passed out inside the Ford Explorer. They managed to get that driver out of the vehicle. While one officer attended to him, the other officer returned to his unit. This is when his patrol unit was struck by the driver of a Toyota Tundra, causing a chain reaction. That is the vehicle you just saw being towed away. According to police, the driver of that Tundra is an off-duty Pasadena police officer. The HPD officer in the unit that was struck is a 15-year veteran. Police say he was walking around but was transported to a nearby hospital to be evaluated for a possible head injury. The off-duty Pasadena police officer was also transported to the hospital for evaluation. It's unclear at this time if alcohol played a role in this crash. As for the initial incident, it's unclear if that was a medical emergency or if the driver was under the influence. Back here live, you can see crews are busy sweeping up what's left of this crash. That Toyota Tundra just towed away seconds ago. So we're hoping this feeder road will be open in the next several minutes. Live this morning, I'm Zach Lajway, KPRC 2 News.